How's it going? Oh, shit. I wish I had my tripod. I totally forgot it. I don't know if that's going to be... It's not good. No good. All right, whatever. Um, I just kind of wanted to make a video because I haven't made one in a while and one talking anyway. And, uh, yeah, I kind of felt like doing that. So how's it going? It's been a while. Uh, what can I tell you? I went to a couple shows this week and it was awesome. Um, if you guys ever heard of Jill Barber, probably not. You've just heard of her. Go check her out. She's fucking awesome. Um, <clears throat> I just kind of heard of her just like this past couple of weeks and um, I got a ticket for a show and then I went and oh my god she's so good live it, it was ridiculous it sounds just like her CD and like the kind of music that she plays is just like it sounds I'm playing it right now and it's like old school it almost sounds like 50s jazz band kind of cool music I don't know it's hard to explain but it's really fucking good and I guarantee you if you listen to it you'd like it and uh, at the show I got to meet her and I got a poster and it's funny because uh, when I went up to her because she said she was gonna sign stuff or whatever so and it was kind of a small place and so that was cool I got to talk to her or whatever and uh, I went up to her and she was so it, it was weird her reaction when she seen that I had her poster she's like oh my god you bought a poster that's awesome and, you know thanks and I was like oh you know no problem can you sign it and stuff so she wrote you know to Jasmine XO Jill Barber or whatever and uh, it was just funny because the reaction was like that I got from her it was like she was like nobody's ever bought one of her posters before kind of thing so it was kind of funny um, and then so my other friends got her to sign her stuff and and when they were sitting there waiting she didn't really say anything and I I know she's like super pretty and so I was, I went up to her, I was like, oh yeah, by the way, you know, you're really pretty. And she's like, oh my god, really? Like, thank you. <laughs> it's funny because it's like she's never been, like, nobody's ever said that to her or something. She was so shocked that I would say something like that. It was funny, but I don't know, her reactions were, it was cute, it was funny. She's really a cool person. She's really nice and stuff, so. And her music is awesome, and live, she just sounds awesome. So I recommend you check it out. And the other show I seen was, uh, <clears throat> they're called Herbalizer, and they're fucking awesome. It's like, there's a DJ uh, scratching over, like, them playing, they got saxophones, they got, like, the jazz flute, they play trumpets, and then they sing, and there's, like, this one chick that sings, and she's got an amazing voice. And so it's it's awesome, man. Like they just play awesome, like cool, trippy music with all those instruments. And so I seen that, and at that show it was at a club, and it, they played at like 11:45 at night to like 2 or 1:30 or something like that. And the crowd, man, like everybody was already so drunk. And there's this like, I swear, he was like 50 years old at the very front. And he's just dancing away and he's like, yeah, come on. And he kept going like this, like, give me more, give me more. And he's like, at the very front of the stage. And so all the people like that were playing, on, like the whole band and everything, they just like seen this guy and they kept laughing at him because he was just like, give me more, yeah, 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 give me more. And it was, it was so funny, man. <laughs> and so me and my friend, we had good spots. It was like upstairs because you can walk upstairs or else you can go down at the bottom of the stage. And we got these good spots where I was like, the band was right there below me. And like, we were kind of behind stage, it kind of looked like, so we can see the front of the crowd over here. And uh, it was crazy because this 50 year old guy is sitting there and there's like this 20 year old chick. And she, you can tell she was like on something or I don't know, just really drunk or something. But she was just like dancing to the music and everything and then all of a sudden this the guy like he was talking to her and stuff and then he like gets her boobs and like jiggles her boobs and she had big boobs it was kind of it was funny because he just like wraps both of his like 
hands over and like is bouncing on man and then I, my friend was beside me and I was like dude man did you just see that and he's like yeah man like what the fuck is she doing like why would she let him do that so then I'm like trying to watch the band but obviously I was a little like interested to see what was gonna happen with this like 50 year old guy and this 20 year old girl to see like oh my god it was so crazy cuz I couldn't believe she would let him do that and then all of a sudden He's like dancing with her and stuff and then he like puts his hand like on her hips and <laughs> oh my god puts her hands on the hips and uh, just starts like grabbing her crotch and shit and then he goes back to her boobs and bounces her boobs again and then she just doesn't do anything and then she kind of turns around and then she like kisses him man and then they kind of kiss and then they start dancing again like it didn't happen. And then me and my friend are just like looking at each other in awe like did you just see that man like oh my god and so we're just listening to the band and like looking over every once in a while see if we can see anything again and all of a sudden I was like I kind of elbow my friend and I was like dude man check it out look down there and you look and the chick fucking had her hand down his pants and his jeans and I was like Oh my god, what the hell, like, I couldn't believe it, it was so, like, gross, man, like, it honestly made me feel sick to my stomach, because he was, like, an old guy with gray hair, and, like, oh my god, I just, I couldn't believe it, I, and that was, like, the high, that points out in my mind more than the band, the band was fucking ridiculously awesome, but, I can't get over how gross I was and how I, I witnessed it, like, I had the perfect spot to see it, like, it was just, it was funny. So I just kind of had to tell you that because it was a funny story and I couldn't, me and my friend were just like, dude, did you see that shit? Like, oh my god. <laughs> but yeah, um, check out Jill Barber and the Herbalizer, fucking awesome people. And, uh, yeah, download, or not download, buy their stuff, because downloading is not supporting. Even though I have a bad habit of doing that, but whenever I go to the shows, I tend to buy their stuff and support the artist, so. And whenever I have money, I buy stuff, so. But yeah, check them out. Go to jillbarber.com. You can listen to her whole CD on her website for free, so check it out. It's awesome. Um. Maybe I'll make another video here because I'm kind of bored and feel like talking. Hopefully you guys are interested and talk to you later.